Tonight, an awesome new development, all thanks to some UCF students and a 3D printer. Yeah, a new device attached to this wheelchair is giving some people, including a Marine, a chance to be more mobile. News 6 reporter Amanda Castro shows us what makes this wheelchair different from all the rest. Charlie is using his face muscles to move the wheelchair forward. It's brand new technology, and the nonprofit behind it hopes that it's going to help people with handicaps gain more independence. Charlie Merritt is using his head. Well, technically, his face. Clench the right side of your jaw to go right, left side of your jaw to go left, so chewing gum's kind of out of the question when you're using it. He's talking about a new 3D printed device created by a team of UCF engineering students and the nonprofit Limitless Solutions. Their goal? enable people with physical disabilities so they can become independent. It's direct control. You're not just pushing a button, but you're really driving it just with, you know, instead of with your arms, but with your face. Full throttle. So we're going to take up the speed. So. Merritt broke his neck in a diving accident last year. He's currently using a device on his own wheelchair to move around. But this new technology is much cheaper, costing less than $500 to build it and making it more available for people who need it. Being able to be a part of something that uh, it's innovative that is, you know, moving forward towards you know, gaining that independence for people that have you know, injuries like mine and MS, ALS. Um, it's, a, it's a good thing. Limitless Solutions plans to use this device to help veterans like Merritt, who suffer from severe spinal cord injuries. You still have a life after it. You can still have a life. In Orlando, Amanda Castro, News 6.